nice people, I'm Waldorf and uh, well, some time has passed, uh, a lot of uh, some time has passed, if you, you can even say that. Anyway, uh, we are back on Tower of Gargalesis. I almost forgot about this game. <laughs> so... Where we left last time... Make me remember... Last time we needed to find... Yes, Lady Venus! We need to defeat Lady Venus to complete our training. I saw some uh, Lamia around here. Okay, let's remember the combat. Engage! Ah, Brace is, uh, yeah, parrying, but I don't want to parry, it's useless here. Let me try, try again. The Claw uses my AD, Adrenaline. I think I use Adrenaline. No, I'm full on ad Adrenaline. I still don't understand. <laughs> And I'm still low on uh, HP. I need to heal! Ah! Luckily I upgraded two times the basic attacks, so I now do a lot of damage. No, I don't want to brace! And uh, she's not dead. Uh, I fear she's charging an attack. Oh, yeah, cool! I can see her! Uh, uh, life points here. Really useful. And just in time. Now, don't waste more time on uh, random encounters, please. So, this Lady Venus, how powerful is she? Really? She sounds like bad news. Strange, I don't even know how powerful she really is. I just know the fairies are like completely terrified of her. If I knew where she was, maybe? I saw something uh, on the east part. She's new? And I need to censor that. <laughs> Xniz Meshroom emerged. She's totally new. She seems uh, really vulnerable, except uh, feet, maybe. Uh, underarms? Ah! One shotted! <laughs> Great! I'm finding a lot of fruit of Knismesis. Nice healing. Not here, there was there was a lake somewhere. But not here. Another new? Gig uh, giggle bun! <laughs> What a name. Also, uh, she has a clock. A reference to Alice and Paese de delle Meraviglie. Or how is it in, in English? <laughs> Alice in Wonderlands, okay, Alice in Wonderlands. Or also a reference to the fact that uh, your time is now to die. Oh, okay, maybe on the belly does not do much damage. Neck? A bit more, okay. But where do these new monsters come from? I need more healing! I need more healing! Oh, wrong zone also. Well, I have one more skill point I can use. Uh, that. Oh, I can uh, go for uh, the brutal pinpoint, which tells you the weakness of the Mamono. But uh, I need a lot of points in another skill trees. This is really cool. Doubles your adrenaline and uh, adds a lot of stamina. Oh, but you lose some. Uh, Proficiency, tech, agility. Well, I just upgraded the basic attack. 
or I need outsider level 4. So another skill here. Another point here. I will upgrade stamina. 50 sounds a lot. 50 is a lot. 50 is a lot. There was a lake here on the left. Right, right. But I don't think she's the Lady Vania or, or the one I have to defeat. Ah, yeah. She's the Momono who summons uh, vines from the earth. <laughs> is, is that Momono from the maids? Great, well, here goes nothing. Hey, you! Oh my, you're the tickly human from the hedge maids. Lucky! Hold it, I know, I know what you are now. Listen, just tell me where I can find Lady Venus. Lady Venus? B why do you want to find her? I, uh, great, even, even this girl is terrified of Lady Venus. Just my luck. You aren't uh, trying to dominate her, are you? Uh, well, I don't know, I'm just here to stop her. Uh -huh. Reign of Terror? You can't dominate her, I, I won't let you! Uh, what? Okay! Boss fight? Before Lady Venus? So... The feet isn't vulnerable. The time... Maybe. So, let's go on tights. Not so much, really. I, I can't even read that fast! Ah. No, I want. I don't want to brace. Uh, snapped her uh, fingers and nothing happened, so I can uh, attack her on neck. Neck doesn't do much damage either. She heals too. She's flustered. There's some kind of uh, game mechanic. I don't understand. She has still a lot of uh, health points and a status, which I don't know what it is. This does much damage, more damage. She and she, why does everyone hiss when she tick tickle me? Maybe because uh, they get uh, excited about it. <laughs> Let's try belly. Belly does some damage too. What? She's protected, so... So... I can try to tickle the hips. The hips does... Uh, on the hips does much more damage. Much more. Six points. Maybe now... She isn't protected, so... It's even more damage. One point. What? I don't understand. She summons something on my ankles, so I can't... Ah, I can't escape, maybe? That's about it. But on scripted battles, you can't escape by default, so... Maybe it isn't that. Let's try again... What was the hips? That's much better! Oh my! You are you're so strong! Please! Please just let me go! Hmm Let her go may be a trap But uh, well no It's not that I kill her so Tick her! Yeah, right, I'm not true with you until you tell me where Lady Venus is. Wait, I will, please just let me go, I promise. Sorry, can't hear you too well right now. I've still got some leaves in my ears. <laughs> oh no, maybe the other choice was uh, quicker. <laughs> you pin her against her own trees and... <laughs> oh yes, she comes with a tree. All uh, on one package. <laughs> And they usually trail your fingers up her bare ties. The dread waste is no time, boosting in the front and giggles, shaking and trembling against you. <laughs> no, 
let the Venus help! It's uh, now that we fight Lady Venus. No, but nobody comes. <laughs> you half expect to see Mamono standing in the bushes, watching angrily. You decide to stop after a lot of dialogue, uh, really, knowing that you still have to find Lady Venus. Waldorf unlocked a profile. Ah, okay. Uh, nice, I guess. Lady Venus likes to stay in the shrine of Gergalesis. It's in the northwest part of the forest. Thanks, I guess. You are welcome, master. <laughs> now I'm the master. It's that easy. Well, easy. It's a, it was a fight, really. It was not really easy. What was that? N nothing. I, I didn't. That was weird. Everything is weird. <laughs> May I correct you? <laughs> I, I told you what I know, please just leave me alone. What did you say before? I didn't say anything. You're lying. Please don't make me say it. Alright, fine. Strange, but uh, yeah, I said uh, everything is strange. <laughs> Let's return to the Butterbee or uh, how she's called. So in the northwest part, oh, not here, here. It should be here, yeah. Mmm, that flower seems really suspicious. And uh, it wasn't here before, so. Lady Venus! You approach a strange flower, feeling an increasing sense of anxiety. Anxiety? Anxiety. Anxiety, yeah. Suddenly the flower begins to move. A woman with green skin and hair rises up from the flower, grinning seductively at you. <laughs> Hello there, sweetie. Have you come to feed me? I bet you taste delicious. No way, I'm here to put a stop to your sick games. Don't you know who I am, sweetie? Lady Venus? Yeah, maybe. Lady Venus, the queen of the tickle woods. I know that, and I'm not... Uh... Afraid? Maybe you should be. Let's give you a test run, shall we? A boss fight, you mean? Sure! Lady Venus emerged! So, I try again on uh, the hips. Medium damage. And she. How much damage does she is? Every attack. The belly now. She has uh, some life points, yeah, but not much. Not uh, a big, enormous amount. No defeat, no, please. Now, isn't that adorable? You're quite a bit tougher than you look. But my, my, I think someone is trying to interfere. What are you talking about? That charming little protection world surrounding you. Why don't we do something about that, huh? No, my hour of uh, undying. Since now the Butterbee uh, revived me every time I died. What happened? What did you do? I feel... I feel weaker! Oh, my dearest, you're on mine! No... Uh, well, now I can't revive uh, when I die, but... Uh, I can manage to do that anyway. That's cool! But that's cool! Th that... Uh, this action increases the stakes, so... I'm up to it! What? No! I... No! Uh, no! I, I thought it was... I thought it was a gimmick of the battle, not a game over scene. You were fun, but you were just a human. You were no match for me. I I'm not beat yet. Oh, but darling, you are. <laughs> no, let go. Vines have wrapped around your wrist and ankles, while more stroke up and down your legs, poke and tickle your sides. Lady Venus smiles and licks her finger, watching you with big, sultry eyes. 
you're getting dragged closer with every laugh and uh, some part of you is becoming foggy staring into her eyes what can I do? oh no oh no give in no please trash wildly no let's do something more considerate please bite the vines with reckless abandon you bite into the vines tearing them with your teeth lady venus screams as you beat her and the vines suddenly retract you beat me you dirty dirty human she seems uh, turned on oh no <laughs> you, i am i know the game uh, from the beginning wasn't normal but but it's getting weirder and weirder <laughs> The vines are coming for you again, and more pollen is filling there. I need to get the hell out of here. That, that was... He ran into a tree! Not... The exit was not on the tree. I, I can't... No, I, I can't beat her. I can't beat her. She's too strong. This can't be the only way. I, I can't. This is too weird. It's too hard. But what choice do I have? God, give me a hand here. Eh? Eh? Again? I have to try again? <laughs> so you came back for more, haven't you? I knew you wouldn't get far. I... Why do you fight it? Just give in. Become my precious, helpless, little tickle prey forever. Uh, no, I won't. I, I stop you. Oh, sweetie, it went so badly last time. Must we go through such teasing uh, formalities? You're tormenting the village and this forest. I w won't let me get away with it. All right then, hero. We'll do this your way. But I won't hold back this time. Uh, hold back? Now she, she's stronger. Okay. Lady Venus. Uh, again, I guess. So. The hips. Uh, was medium damage. Belly. Let's try the belly. The belly too is medium damage. Or. Uh, or she has uh, a lot of defense. The. Underarms. Or I, I just try the underarms. Yeah, some damage. How much damage does? Well, one attack and I'm dead. And she has a, still a lot of la life. Ooh. A fruit? How much uh, do I heal? Enemy stamina, that's nothing! That's nothing! And she is! She heals too! Let's try the claw! Same damage. And game over. Okay, game over scene. I know, I know. When you come to realize that you can't speak, nor can you see anything. Something thick and leafy covers your mouth, and all around you feels sick and wet. You shudder, feeling lit. Lit? Light. Light. Light, like uh, flexures, I guess. Stroking across your naked skin, her husky, breathy voice whispers in your ear, and your heart runs cold. Now you're going to play for real. I hope you have a lot of energy because I can go for days without rest when I have a delicious human to feed on. Her fingers slide down your bare back, lightly stroking your equally bare backside. Your giggles are muffled by the gag, but... By the gag? You mean uh, the leaf on your mouth? This doesn't seem to bother your capture. If anything, she looks even hungrier. Uh, we get there, my dear, eventually. But first, I'm going to make you beg me to eat you. I'm going to tickle you until I hear a sincere plea. Better start screaming. Ah, yeah, she's like a carnivorous plant. But in this world, uh, 
they don't eat. Uh, she just tickles, <laughs> like everything else. Not only does it tickle horribly, but you feel hot. In which sense hot? Please. <laughs> and arouse with every teasing touch and it seems like the more you try to beg for release the harder it is to do anything but laugh game over boy the boss fight is really hard maybe because i have uh, really less health let's try again but i fear i need more health or defense Let's do another try, maybe searching for a weak spot, and then we make upgrades. Oh, let's try the ribs. Even never try the ribs. Same damage. Well, on the neck, it, she does not uh, damage. When she comes for the hips or the feet, it's a problem. Neck I tried, let's try the foot, but I fear, uh, yeah, she's unaffected because she has no foot, <laughs> realistically. Uh, can, even the knees does not damage her, right? So, I think uh, tights, knees and foot does not damage. The neck? The neck does more damage. Maybe if I attack her neck and she doesn't attack my feet, I can win. I don't think she has a lot of life points. But let's try. Maybe I should learn some status move to improve my damage. Maybe. But the... Oh no. What? I'm tangled and... So, I'm tangled and she he's 125, almost full. Ah, you're just so delicious. I think I know just how to deal with you. Ah, we are going to just have the best time, darling. You start back in confusion, then scream in terror as a hundred vines whip out the ground and spread you out for Lady Venus' pleasure. An amorous grin passes her lips as the vines stand poised. Poised. Uh, balanced, okay. And ready around you. Now why I don't... Now why I don't show you the real tickle torture, huh? I hope you can keep up. It would be such a shame if you only lasted a little while. I like to play with my meals. She gestures lazily. Your eyes lock on the single vine that approaches with deadly leisure. You swallow hard and clench your eyes shut tightly, waiting for the harsh torture that awaits. To your shock, the stiff vine lightly brushes against your ear. Taken by surprise, you yelp before clamping your mouth shut tightly. Lady Venus chuckles, resting her chin on one hand. Mm, I can already tell you're going to be a fun meal. Let the games begin. Tickle prey. The vine lightly brushes your cheek, passes over your lips and slides down your neck. You begin to sweat, trying with all your might to resist the teasingly soft tickles. It does nothing to discourage the vine, now stroking your armpit with feather softness. Long, slow, gentle strokes that feel al almost as if they aren't even there. The vine trails across your chest, lazily drawing circles in your other armpit. A high-pitched squeal beats in your throat. Lady Venus grins and leans on both hands. Watching hungrily. What do you say, my pet? Are you going to keep fighting me? You can feel your stamina slipping away with every cruel stroke. If you don't break free soon, you won't be able to keep fighting. What will you do? No, I never give you up! 
Insult doesn't do anything, I fear. Let's tag on... Uh, wrist, so I have my hands free. Not wanting to give you in so easily, you give a fierce tag on the vines holding your wrists. You nearly break free, but uh, just as you can feel them give, they snap back into place. Now they hold you even tighter. You swallow as Lady Venus wags her finger and grins deviously. Ah, oh, na na na, it's not going to be that easy, little pet. No, if you want to play, you'll need to play to win. The vine stroke in your armpit uh, slips down and begins gently teasing your belly. You beat your lip and your cheeks bulge. The vine slips around the edge of your belly button as if taunting you. You know it will be attacking soon, but uh, when we soon be, you bite your lip harder as the vine slides down and gently strokes your hip and trails up your back. You sputter and clench your teeth when it passes over your neck and slides down your chest. Lady Venus smirks and bites her finger to contain her giddiness. Giddiness? Dizziness? Okay. I know your weakness, little tickle prey. I can break you whenever I want. I just love seeing you so flustered. Oh, it's just so delicious. The vine trails down your side and slides across your quivering belly once again. It circles your belly button one last time before slipping inside and softly brushing the edges with its damnably thin tip. The sudden soft tickling in your navel is the last straw and Sneaker fights its way free, quickly opening the path for a wave of giggles. Tears are welling up in your eyes. Your face feels like it's on fire. Even the sweet trickling down your body feels tickly. Now tears begin rolling down your cheeks, mingling with the sweet streaking your face. The slow, meticulous, never-changing tickling is driving you insane. Ah oh, yes, that's it, tickle prey. Can you take any more? I don't think you can. Why don't you just give up now? Never gonna give me up! You're slowly going insane. Every soft tickle drains more and more of your stamina. Can you really take more? Never gonna give me up! So that was the wrong answer, that, but uh, nothing happened. Just a big, uh, really big line of text. <laughs> Tag on ankles! You clench your eyes shut and tug as hard as you can on your ankles. You manage to get your knees bent, but the vines quickly pull your legs back out. Tighter than before. Oh, naughty, naughty. Are you trying to get away? Oh, I know. Your poor little feet feel so neglected, don't they? We can fix that. Oh, yes, we can, little prey. Oh, no. You try to tug again, but a thin little vine strokes against your soul, breaking your concentration. You fall into a fit of giggles, which escalate when the vine in your belly button starts tickling a little faster. It repeats this process, flickling and stroking a different toe each time. The vine in your belly button pokes and pros to the deepest part of the button. It's not normal talking about vines that go inside a button. <laughs> a button! You know what a button is? <sighs> well, not a belly button, yeah. Wiggling and vibrating just enough to send a current of tickles through your quivering stomach. Lady Venus leans back and stretches, arching her back and lightly rubbing her breasts. She licks her lips and grins at you. Ah, uh, it's over, little trickle meal. I'm more ready for you. Mm, you're going to have so much fun. Realizing you have no way to escape, you lower your head and sob harder. The vines tug you toward Lady Venus, 
still tickling you in a mixture of quick vibration and slow little strokes. It's all over. No! What? Again? What do I need to do? Insult her? Surrender? What? I need to insult her? Game over, again. But, uh, no. I'll go buy some equipment. If there is one, I don't remember, really. Let's see. I have a lot of, uh, not money, but a lot of tick lessons, which is, uh, well, double the money. More than 600 money. I should be fine. I give you 1000. Oh yeah, you have no idea how happy I am. 500 coins. I keep a bit more. You you never know. I have also a side quest here. Yeah. Some shirt. I need some shirt. Plus zero. What shirt is that? Ah, it's my shirt. I already have that. So I don't uh, know how to spend my money. Great. Okay, let's try again. Now it's the time. I know her weak point, the neck. Take that. Okay, my belly is uh, safe. Just hope uh, she doesn't tickle my feet or my ankles. Arm pizza. It's fine, it's fine. She heals, but she heals. She heals herself, but I did uh, a nice amount of damage. No, my feet, no! Not my feet! I need to heal. Uh, I have some tomato juice, so... I, I drink one of that, uh, I guess. <laughs> 45 stamina? It's not much. I'm also dizzy. What does that mean? What's dizzy? Dizzy. It's like blindness. It makes, I guess, sense because uh, when you're dizzy you can't tickle uh, really well. But this appears on hit, so I can spend this turn to heal my myself. Okay, now hit me. Okay, okay. I'm not... Uh, I no more did did do <laughs> Neck, again! Take that! More damage! No! What? No! Now she comes in this phase, yeah. But now I have to... Insult her? I, I mean, uh, I don't see any other choice unless uh, first wrist and then ankles. But I don't think. Insult the Venus! I never surrender you. Uh, you're going uh, down pretty uh, heavy eh, here. Never! So that's how you, it's going to be? You want to be difficult or bad, do you? Well, why don't I show you how bad I can be? The vine slowly tracing a path across your chest comes to a, an abrupt halt. You bite your lip and clench your eyes shut, unsure of what to expect. Vines swarm you on all sides, digging into your ribs, stroking your armpits, flicking across your soles, poking your belly, everything! <laughs> Write everything and I understand quicker. Fluttering across your neck, caressing your tights, prodding your knees and squeezing your hips. Everything, yeah. Before you can think to take a breath, you are screaming at the top of your lungs for mercy. Oh god, uh, stop, please! Think you can take me? Don't forget me. <clears throat> you should have thought uh, twice before running your mouth. This will teach you, won't it? Oh, we're going to have so much fun. Well, no, that was the wrongest choice. So, what can I choose? Bef I have to choose one and then the, the other. I don't understand. I 
I think first one and then the, the other. The opposite way I did, maybe. Let's try again. Or maybe I have to surrender, but it's uh, weird. But uh, yeah, it's a bit uh, suspicious because uh, the choice to uh, surrender is uh, the first one. Yeah, it's a bit suspicious. No, there. Are... Ah, I don't have weak armpits. I remembered uh, differently. Oh well, let's go. Ah, no, no, not the armpits. My other weak point is my. Yeah, my hips. Yeah, it's uh, curious how the weak points in the game it's, are the same in uh, real life. The more you know. <laughs> so... Let's try to give up. No, please, I can't take it anymore. Please, make it stop. Oh, so soon. Well, I knew you'd give up. They always do. <laughs> I have plans for you, my delicious tick lips spray. Wait, no, so it was the opposite. Or maybe it was first, the first is right, then insult her. I don't know, I don't know. Ah, it's complicated, it's hard. Ah, this is the time. So let's try first the wrists. No, I tried first the wrists. So, the ankles? Summoning your main strength, you tug hard on the vines holding your ankles. They stretch a few inches, but they... But then quickly pull back, stretching you taut once more. Lady Venus notices and wags a finger with a smirk. Silly prey, you can't get away so easily. I think someone needs to be punished. Mm, are those delicious feet ticklish too? No, not the feet! The, but the dialogue here is different, so maybe it's working? The vine slides down your side, just barely touching your skin. It slips around your ankle and begins to caress the top of your foot. Your face is now bright red, sweet and tears, and streaking down your face. The vine lightly teases your toes, stroking from the base to the tips, then returning even softer. You just barely manage to stifle a scream when the vine very tenderly slides between your toes and gently comes back over the top of your foot. That's it, little prey. There's no escape. It will only get worse every long 30 second you spend fighting. Oh, I can't wait to watch you break my sensitive little morsel. Morsel. Ah. Bite. <laughs> the vine slips under your foot, lightly stroking your soul with all the intensity of a baby's breath. As the tip of the vine caresses your tender arch, it becomes too much to take and you, you burst into a flurry of giggles. Lady Venus only grins and links forward in her, in her flower, drinking in the fr fronting stream of la laughter. You throw your head back and squeal, giggle and trash trang with all your might to get free. These actions do nothing to deter the slow, methodical piece of the delicate vine brushing across your wide, widely flexing toes. You're Poor thing, oh, this must be simply too much for you. Aren't you tired of this little game? Don't you just want to surrender? She's right, the torture is quickly becoming too much. You aren't sure just how much more of this soft teasing you can take. What will you do? Never gonna give me up! This time, tag on wrists! Despite the giggles, you grit your teeth and tag as hard as you can. Maybe... First you have to fight and then to surrender or insult her? I don't know! I have to try! <laughs> you grit your teeth on the vines holding your wrist. They start to give only to snap back into place, stretching you even tight, tighter than before. Ah, oh, so that's how you want to play? Well, that sounds so fun! 
Why don't we make things even more interesting? A second vine stretches out and lightly brushes against your side. Great! Another problem! Caught off guard, you squeal and burst into a forceful peal of giggles and shrieks. Your torment has reached new devious heights. One vine lightly strokes your helpless feet, while the other teasingly caresses your armpit. The dwelling touch of the two soft vines keeps your mind torn and hazy, preventing you from even contemplating resistance. Lady Venus licks her lips and leans over her petal, giving you a look that offers no other option. I think this is the end of the line for you, my delicious little prey. I knew you would lose, they all do. <laughs> oh, the things I have planned for you. Mixed with the ticklish tears, tears of hopelessness roll down your cheeks. There really is no way out, no way to win. Lowering your head, still giggling helplessly, you give up. And that's it, bro! And that's it, wrong too! What do you have to do to win? What? Insult her? Give up? I don't know! <sighs> So, first I think tag on uh, ankles, because uh, if I give up on insult, uh, I lose. So, one of these two is the right first uh, option. Maybe both? But ankles sounds better, I guess? And now, this is wrong. Now if I give up uh, on insult her, I, I don't know, this option kills you before. Insult the Venus! That's the same uh, line. No! Lady Venus gasps and draws back, as if physically assaulted by your harsh words. She quickly recovers, narrowing her eyes and sneering. So that's how it's going to be? Well then, the kiddie gloves are off. I want you to scream. I want to watch you suffer before I have my way with you. So, here, that's, uh, I think, different. Uh, now, four uh, vines uh, are coming. Before, uh, she attacks you with uh, everything. Even as a vine begins tickling between your toes, you can feel more tiny vines uh, wrapping around the toes of other foot. Of the other foot. Rather than suffering the same foolish assault of its twin, instead it suffers the former fate but quadrupled. Four slim vines, even smoother and sleeker than the first, lightly trace the sole of your toad foot. The mixture of furious and teasing, harsh and soft is horrifying. Lady Venus smirks and leers at you. What about now? Um, am I still a war? I don't forgive you for that. You're going to have to beg me. Let me hear that. Beg me for mercy. Beg me to take you and end this. Your chest hurts, your head is foggy and you have never laughed so hard in, in all your life. Can you really take another second of this? If you can't, you won't, you won't have the strength to keep going. But if you give up... No! No! This is the time! Never gonna give me up! To go wrists! With no other op option, we put the last of your strength into a last ditch bid for freedom. To your surprise, when you tug, the vines snap and you crumble to the ground. Lady Venus screams and stumbles back, staring at you in horror and holding her now sore body. How? Oh, that's... you can't... no, you can't... <laughs> Are you ready for round two? Round two it is, yeah! I can keep fighting! Take this! She has absolutely... What? She is? Well, it doesn't change much, really. She has less than half health. Health, yeah. Now, hit her. Uh, tickle her, it's uh, right. Shush. 12 damage, that's nothing. Oh, again. Again, again, again. Take that. No. 
Sì, sì, l'ingolot I have to heal too Tomato juice Please Nice Do no, Not on the feet, please Tights, ok Why does every monster heal? Why? Oh, no Ah, she gets adrenaline Not, uh, she doesn't re Not uh, regain stamina So I won I won <laughs> Yeah No, please stop please. I can't take any more of this Please, just, just no more Please She seems really sorry She's crying and curled up in her flower. Will you really let her go after what she did to you? No! Tickle her! What? What are you? No, please, I'm so sorry. Please, don't do that. No! I'm moved by her fronting, please. You pin her arms back, tying them to her own roots with her own fallen vines. Lady Venus struggles frantically, but is rooted to the ground by her flower. And held down by her own, own vines. I'm going to make sure you never hurt anyone again. It's time for your lesson, monster. No, please, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm too ticklish. In this world, it's, it's tickle or be tickled. That's exactly what you probably want to uh, hear. Shamelessly, you lightly stroke her exposed armpits. The Venus screams and tugs at the vines, but is too tired to make an escape. Making a note of that, you dig your fingers into her bare belly. <laughs> Stop, please, no more! With a snort, you pluck a blade of grass from the forest. Oh no, this is just devilish. You raise an eyebrow and lightly try the blade of grass across her belly. The reaction is instant. The Venus begins howling. Ignoring her, you lightly trace the edge of her belly button. Still, you can't help but return your gaze to her jiggling chest. She didn't bother to spare your modesty. Why spare hers? You are going to the uh, not family friendly content. <laughs> with a resolute nod and a devious grin, you lightly stroke her large breast with a blade of grass. Lady Venus uh, back arches and she lets out a feral scream. Nectar tears rolling down her green cheeks. Not my, not my beautiful breast! <laughs> Even in the face of torture, she's uh, an arrogant as ever. You roll your eyes and flick the blade of grass across her firm nipple. Ah, yeah, because she doesn't wear anything, uh, I see. Lady Venus screams and tugs uh, with all her might, even managing to sit up somewhat uh, to look you in the eye. You only grin and pluck another blade of grass. She simply stares at you in disbelief, sobbing uncontro uncontrollably. Without a shade of sympathy, you brush the twin blades across both nipples, sending her into convulsions. Her la laughter fills the entire forest. Before long, her green face is red and her beautiful body is cocked in a sticky sweat substance. substance. Perhaps her form of sweet. Okay, I don't want any more to tickle her, please. Or even play this game. I guess. <laughs> it's too soon when she finally falls back, her eyes rolling up in her head and blacks out. With a disappointed sigh, you brush off your clothes and leave her where she lays. Ah, I won! Ah, she disappeared. But uh, it was uh, <laughs> really long today to beat one, one single boss. But again, w wait. What happens if you spare, spare her? Just a curiosity, I just wanna know. So if I let her go, Fine, you can go, <clears throat> but if you cause any more trouble, I won't be as nice. Lady Venus gaps and nods, smiling a tearful smile. But thank you, thank you so much, you're the most beautiful human I've ever met. Please, please take this, please, it's so... Oh, thank you. 
Ah, if you spare the monsters, they give you items. Cool. I didn't know that. What did she gave me? Ah, no, 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 it's this. <clears throat> Completely heals you, it's overpowered. <laughs> nice, so you can miss healing items by choosing the wrong option. Or if you can die at the boss fight choosing the wrong option. But still, this boss is uh, interesting. Apart the fact that you can die if you take the wrong choice. It's a boss fight uh, that lasted long. And not because uh, she has a lot of HP. She does that scene in the middle, in the middle of the battle that uh, make you lose. But it would have been cooler if uh, the boss, uh, when you make the wrong choice, doesn't kill you, but uh, does you a lot of damage, at, for example, or uh, entangles you, makes uh, a status effect on you, I don't know. Making you lose if you make the wrong choice is awful. But uh, it's a curious, interesting mechanic, I have to say. <laughs> so, for today is really more than enough. <laughs> We beat Lady Venus after one hour and ten minutes. So, for today is enough. I will continue when the time comes. I will continue sometimes, I, I guess. I don't know when, as this episode. So, thank you for watching. And uh, I'll see ya whenever happens.